Okay, so as per recommendation, we're playing this game today. I I don't know what to expect. I saw some pictures and it looks really cute. A lot okay. of this isn't going to make sense to you. And I'm sorry about that. All right. I'm just going to start at the beginning with the house. Sure. Increase the volume a bit. All right. Always look behind you first, guys. Always. Do we have feet? We do. And a little belly. I lived here until I was 11, but oh. I wasn't allowed inside half the rooms. Were you... Were you Belle? Did you... Do you have a beastie friend? Is she pregnant or is she just like... You know... Bloated. <laughs> That's cute. Did she live in the Baba Yaga house? What is this? Hello? Oh my god, that's such a cute sweater. What the heck? I want it. Inside the mailbox were bills from seven years ago. Marked what? urgent. Open immediately. Maybe you should open it. We're seven years late. That is so cute. Is that the house? Oh. I hadn't been back since my brother Lewis's funeral. Do we... Sure. Can we zoom? We can. This property is protected by vendors of islands, trespassers, something. My god, I would love this. I would be out exploring all the time. In her will, my mother left me a key, but didn't tell me what it unlocked. Oh. Maybe she thought I'd know. Or she thought that the mystery would be enough to bring me back. <laughs> you got finchers. Yes. Do we go up or do we go down? Hmm. Right's always right, so let's go left. Okay. Look at them little toes. <laughs> this is scary. Zoom. No. The truth is, even after I inherited the house, I never thought I'd come back to it. Really? Why? But now I had questions about my family that only the house knew the answers to. Oh, well, okay. Sure. Sure, lady. Sure, lady. Look at that little belly. Did I go? Did I go the correct way? Now was I supposed to go up there and find like the it's locked? The woods around the house have always been uncomfortably oh, silent, as if they're about to say something but never do. That is a really nice voice actor. You keeping secrets? Yeah, that is quiet. That is a bit scary. That's a bit scary. I'm not gonna lie. There's some telephone poles going on. <laughs> the house was exactly like I remembered it. The way I'd been dreaming about it. All crazy like? Sure. How? how where? Where are you gonna go with that truck? Oh. That way? I answered my own question. Good. I am a clever bean. Found the glitch. Found the little glitch. It's gleaming right at me. Wah wah wah. What? Oh my god. Hi. You can make this into a little treasure house. What the heck? It's so pretty. I want it. Oh. Milton Finch, was that the brother? I am really crappy with names. As a child, the house made me uncomfortable in a way I couldn't put into words. Why? Now, as a 17 year old, I knew exactly what those words were. I was afraid of the house. Why? I would be scared of the floating letters everywhere. Hello. 
me. Oh, really? Mm. Crawling through the doggy door used to be a lot easier when I was 11. Cute. The power had been turned off the night we left. Oh. Oh no, is this gonna be one of them scary games? I don't do very well with scary games. Take the saw. You fight off the bears. For the first time in years. Yeah? I felt like I was home. Oh my god. I but instead love of it. a family, there were just memories of one. Uh. Chinese takeout like though. Like only one restaurant would deliver to our house. So we had Chinese a lot. <laughs> Or how after Lewis started working at the cannery, we all got sick of eating salmon. Except mm -hmm. our cat, Molly. Yeah, I can see that. Do we have a... do we have a... Light source somewhere? Oh my god! Yeah, I'd get sick of it too, and... Whoa. The table was still a wreck from the night we left. What happened? Why did they... It was like a bomb had gone off, killing everyone but sparing the furniture. Sure... My mom was the only one of us who could imagine Great Grandma Edie living in a nursing home. <laughs> it's always one. Ah, he saved. Guys, it's fine. He went to public market in... Seattle. Nothing in the house looked abnormal. There was just too much of it. Like a smile with too many teeth. Oh, that's a way not a nice way to describe it. I like that. Yes, it is quite cluttered. Even the fireplace had a story. Yeah. Edie told me the bricks came from the original house after it sank. Huh? What is with Oh. What was with that? Come back, letters. And that's a nice TV. Down, Finch. Did they just move it? My goodness, I love that. What is that? It's a saw. Cool. We paint it on the paint it on the saw. Let's do this one first. Oh, spin, spin. Great Grandpa Sven built a music box for Barbara, mm -hmm. along with the rest of the house. Cute. Why is uh, Bigfoot in the background, though? Sure. Hmm? Oh, my friend will love these bug collections. She's crazy about bugs. She's a crazy little bug. I thought I saw a shadow up there. Huh? Melon. No, didn't work. All right. Well. My mom wasn't much of an optimist, but she never stopped believing that my brother Milton was alive. Hmm. A lot of things got left behind in the whirlwind of that last night. Speak clearly, girl. Why are you speaking riddles? After Milton disappeared, yeah. Mom sealed up all the bedrooms. Oh. Then Edie retaliated and drilled peepholes. <laughs> okay. Holy... Why would you have a picture like that? That is... Uh, creepy. Ah, uh, that sort of freaks me out too, actually. Boo. I spent a lot of time playing Whoa. in Great Uncle Walter's room. I think my mom sometimes regretted not sealing it up. Dude, that is crazy. I love that. Okay. Lewis told me there were secret passages, but I never believed him. Hmm. Do you reckon? Oh! 
<laughs> Turns out my mom was really good at keeping secrets. Whoa! Now it was time to find out what my mom had been afraid of. Okay, but we missed something. Oh. Let's just go. Reading this, maybe it sounds like I had a plan. From the paintings on the wall, it was clear my brother Milton had been here before me. <laughs> oh no, don't tell me you're gonna find Milton somewhere. Wow. And he had a place to piss! But I had no idea what was behind that door. Well, neither did we, so... Now we're two. Just like I had no idea where all this was gonna lead. Whoa! Well, it wasn't very well hidden from the other side, my good. Um... Humus? No? I grew up looking at Molly's room through the peephole. <laughs> what? <laughs> really? Molly's gerbil Girl. had a tiny bedroom with its own even tinier gerbil cage. Let's close it. No? Thanks. Is that- oh, uh, it's a toilet roll. It's tiny pieces of poops. Being inside for the first time? I felt like I'd stepped behind a painting. Wow, okay, so we're actually... Okay, so what? Where's the people? Where's the peepee hole? Oh wait, that's the Mass Effect uh, squid, right? Hmm... So why was Molly's room sealed off? 1940... <gasps> no... Just a baby. December 13th, oh 1947. My Dear Diary, I'll be gone soon, but I wanted to tell somebody about what's going to happen. It started when Mom sent me to bed without dinner. I woke up and I was starving, so I looked around for something to eat. You want to eat some hamster poop? The gerbil food was dry, but I didn't mind it. Are you serious? My Halloween candy was all gone. No. Oh. Um. Oh, look. Can I? I thought, I thought about eating Christopher, but I held back. Good. <laughs> Good girl. Don't eat Christopher. What? What kind of nightmare are you stuck in? Okay. Uh, yes. Mom, can I come out now? Oh my god. It's late. Go to sleep. I'm hungry though. Why would you let a freaking 10 year old something old? My god. Go to bed hungry. I mean, don't need dinner. Just freaking give them something else. What the hell? You I kept eating and eating. Oh my god. Ugh. No, don't. Oh no. I ate a lot of things that night. Oh no. Then I heard chirping outside my window. Mm hmm. It was a barn swallow going back to her nest. Oh lord. I reached out for her. Oh lord. Oh no, don't. And suddenly. <gasps> huh? I was a cat! With no paws! Oh. What the heck is going on? I tried on? to be quiet, but the bird was really scared.
for you. What's uh, done? Meow. <laughs> Mom and Dad didn't even look at me. Okay. Whoa, that's one nimble cat. I jumped and I almost got her. <laughs> no? I could tell she was getting really tired. Wow. Now I was up in the big tree. You were indeed. I promised that I wouldn't climb it anymore. What? All I cared about was eating that mama bird. I gobbled her up. <gasps> and mm -hmm. suddenly, I was an owl. First, all I heard was the wind. Then I heard little teeth nibbling in the grass. All right. we are doing right now. <laughs> oh my god, no. I imagined his face looking at Oh, I don't want to. No, no. No. I swallowed him up and I didn't chew one bit. But you... Then I flew mm -hmm. off to find something bigger. Like your conscience? You want to eat a moose or something? A mama rabbit. Oh my god. I I don't like the this heart. It's almost too big to carry. Oh I gosh. started choking, but I couldn't stop eating. But suddenly, I was a shark. Oh my god. Okay. I don't understand what's happening. Wait. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> oh my god, okay. I rolled off a oh. cliff and into the ocean. And okay. Now, I was hungrier than ever. What is going on? Juicy suits. Okay, yeah. I'm not sure the seals agrees, but okay. on your side until that point, you know? Grabbed on tight. Oh but I was so hungry, I jumped out of the water. When I opened my eyes, everything had changed. Oh my! Yeah, just wiggle back on me. Yes, I will make a knot on myself. <laughs> oh No way I could do without this sound Now I was a monster And mm -hmm. I smelled people everywhere All right. So you're ending up eating a person? I hmm. was big, but I moved real quiet. Yes! Ah! 
Jumper Jumpers. It's a new Assassin's Creed game, you know? I wanted to stop, but also, I didn't. <laughs> okay. Yeah, do with a drunken sailor, eat him as a squid doll. really understand what's going on here. Um, what? I slithered onto the sand, and the good smell went into an old pipe. Mm-hmm, okay. Yeah, yes, um, absolutely. Oh, we're in the latrine. <laughs> oh yeah, we are the yuck. How did that smell good? Closer and closer. Mm -hmm. Oh no! What did we smell? Uh, All of my stomach started growling. Oh no. And suddenly, I was me again. I held my breath for a long time. Okay. story Molly you cray cray absolutely cray cray I'm not sure if I believed all of that mm -hmm. but I'm sure Edie would have mm. Ingeborg Odin Molly Barbara Sven Edie Calvin Sam Walter Odin Ingeborg Kay okay. Gregory, Gus, Don. What a mix of names. Wow. I got the sense Edie had spent a lot of time here. Yeah. Before my mom sealed the doors. Mm hmm. Yeah. Seems like it. Seems uh, like it. This will be obvious later, but my mom never told me any of these stories. Edie would have, but mom didn't like bringing up the past. Hmm. Though, when we adopted a stray kitten, she was the one who named it Molly. I spent a lot of time in Great Grandma Edie's room. We got along, and it was a good place to hide from my mom. <laughs> what? Oh. Lewis died a week before we left, but Edie had already started to memorialize him. What? What? Edie knit me a new pair of gloves every year, just in time to replace the old ones. Hmm. Molly, Barbara, Calvin, Sam, Walter. Wow. That, hmm. Her room was like a museum. Same painting, though. We really like that painting, eh? For 500 years, the Finches have been famous throughout Norway for their fortune. Oh. Uh, and misfortune. Yeah, apparently. Can I... No, well... 
I sort of wanted to... Oh, yeah. Odin Finch buries the latest victims of the family curse. His wife, Ingeborg, and their newborn Inge son, body. Johan. Next On one. January 7th, 1937, he set sail with his family and his house, hoping to leave the curse behind. Oh, wait, took the whole house? But 40-foot waves off <gasps> the coast of Washington send the house and Odin to the bottom of the sea. Hmm. Odin's daughter Edie, with husband Sven and baby Molly, step ashore on their new home, Orcas Island. Odin Finch is the first to be buried in the new family cemetery. Oh. His daughter Edie is already dreaming of a new Finch house. Oh yeah, fireplace. Okay. Get out. Oh. Whatever's wrong with this family, it goes back a long ways. Hmm. Big, big ass curves. Eh? Oh my god. What are all of these books? The Odyssey? The Prince and the Goblin? Norwegian folktales. Yes. We come from Norge. No, that's not Norwegian at all. That's just a Swedish accent. Stupid language. 1937. When Edie told people Sven was killed by a dragon, <laughs> she could also have said he was building a dragon-shaped slide that collapsed. Mm -hmm. She could have, but she didn't. <laughs> mm, I wouldn't either. Oh, wow. Dragon kiss Finch. Yeah, mm. It sort of makes it a little bit funny, though. Even in her 90s. Sometimes Edie seemed a lot younger than my mother. Mm hmm. What? Just never. Absolutely never. Oh! Oh, I love that. <laughs> the <laughs> love only trace like Grandpa that. Sam's first wife Kay left on the house was the pink bathroom. Mm hmm. It was yeah. a pretty big trace. Yeah. Zoom. Wait, really? There's a secret in the bathroom. Apparently. So this key opens all of the secret doors? There's a secret in this bathroom. Oh. Yeah. It's in the last place you would look. He's nodding and agreeing. No, I was just joking. Open it again. It isn't in the cupboard. Mm -hmm. It's hidden in this book. Lol. Okay. Thanks. What? Huh. Wait, what? I don't know if that means one year or... Oh, creepy. Sven gave Sam an old camera he'd refurbished. He never put it down. Same one. Same one, yeah. So he had a little uh, in between rooms. I mean, what? Even more Milton. We. Fort Calvin. Grandpa Sam had a twin. Yeah. And then um. he never talked about him. Oh, why? Oh, I, I love this. I guess my grandpa didn't like history any more than my mom did. Oh. <gasps> oh. How I Want to Remember My Brother hmm. by Sam Finch. The thing I remember is that when he made up his mind, that was it. <laughs> Oh no, look at the foot. 
<laughs> my brother said he'd die before he ate another mushroom. And he did. Oh, wow. I love the shoe, At though. Barbara's what funeral, a flipper. He swore he'd never be afraid again. And he wasn't. Are we jumping? I think Calvin always wanted to fly. Yeah, okay. We. But that day, he finally made up his mind to do it. Okay. We're doing it? I told him going around was impossible. <laughs> maybe if I hadn't said that. Yeah, maybe. That does sound like a challenge. Oh my god. I'm not gonna tell you again. Maybe if the wind hadn't picked up. Oh my god. Then maybe he'd still be here. But I doubt it. Oh, this I is making me so dizzy. That's what I want to oh remember about God. my brother. <gasps> oh my God. The day he made up his mind to fly. And he did. Whoa. Calvin's story felt strangely familiar. When I was younger, I remember trying to do the exact same thing. Mm-hmm. I think most kids did that, actually. Eleven years old? Dude. Like, like flies. Oh my god, man. After the funeral, Edie roped off Calvin's half of the room. Yeah. Oh. Oh my god, they're so cute. Mom said Grandpa Sam enlisted at 18 and never set foot in the room again. Hmm. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, um, no, dude, that is that's sad. No, I don't want to think about that. No, 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 no. I'm done. Done thinking about that. Eh? What? Oh. Do we... Oh. How could she have missed all of these secret little doors and stuff? I never believe there were any secret doors and they're just literally, the literally were everywhere. Tight fit. Yeah. They'd obviously been built for smaller hands and bellies. Hehehe, <laughs> smaller hands and bellies. Where do we want to go? I don't, I don't know what. There, we just open it and then we go there. Milton again, huh? Bigfoot. Growing oh. up, I always thought of Barbara as a child star. Hmm? Ah! No! A brace here! Is that what they, they're called? I don't know. Wow. I never thought about how hard it must have been for her afterwards. Okay. Afterwards what? Of all the stories people wrote about Barbara's death, I'm surprised Edie saved this one. Oh, Jack here with another ghastly tale inspired by America's most unfortunate family. I'm calling it The Surprise Ending of Barbara Finch. As a child star, mm -hmm. Barbara was famous for her scream. Now at 16, she was all washed up. Or has been. But in a lucky break, she'd been asked to perform her signature scream at a local convention for monster movie fans. 
It was just the boost her career needed. Unfortunately, her scream hadn't aged well. <laughs> mm, getting better. I think you just need the right motivation. Her biggest fan and oh. current boyfriend, Rick, was about to demonstrate when... Oh my. Now that was a great scream. It was Barbara's father, Sven. He'd slipped into a table saw and had to be rushed to the emergency room. So Barbara got stuck babysitting her youngest brother, Walter. Oh her no, the horror. Was canceled. <laughs> okay, I'm hearing frustration, but I'm not hearing terror. What if I tried... A gang of hoodlums and Halloween masks have been terrorizing Orca's Island tonight. Police are urging residents to... Oh my gosh. That came from the basement. You're right. Also, I loved your delivery on that. <laughs> Why is your basement door locked? Because my dad likes making puzzles in secret passages. Oh yeah, we didn't There's even try to go. The, music box. Oh. the secret is to keep winding and winding until finally the key pops out. Oh. Thanks, babe. I'll be back in a sec. Cool way to deliver later, that. Rick hadn't returned. Oh no. So Barbara went to look for him. Right on cue. She reached for the music box. And as she wound the key, she listened for Rick. But the house was silent. Why am I doing this? I'm controlling this part. It's super scary. Oh no. She found Rick's crutch and imagined the worst. Oh no. Away with you. I am busy. I shall not save Rick. I am a horror. My god. Let me throw. Gang's leader is the infamous hookman killer, Dr. Carl Hamill, who impaled and then ate his family ten years ago tonight. Oh no, shut up, stupid radio. You're scaring me. Also, what the heck? That thing is gonna move or something. Punk, punk! Get out of my way! Get out of you! I'm busy! Oh dear! Oh dear! T oh. Rick? Barb, yeah. relax! Yeah. <laughs> I was just trying to scare you to help you find your scream. Well, I'm not scared, Rick. I'm furious. Yes, I then would be too. act furious. Mm. All I'm getting from you now is that you're hurt and confused and you <laughs> She threw him out, but she kept a little something to remember him by. The crutch. Barb, have you seen my other crutch? And she was still holding it mm. when she fell asleep watching the late, late picture show. The picture Hours show? Later, Barbara! Walter, what's going on up there? Ah! Hmm? Okay, I'm coming up. But if this is a trick... <laughs> okay, dead, I'm coming up. Again? With this? Well, you better watch out. I'm dangerous with the crutch. I can't break anything. I'm so disappointed. Jo Who the heck threw that? Walter, are you there? I swear I'll slap you, Walter. Residents are urged to lock all doors and windows and notify the police of any suspicious activity. I returned, saw the hook man, and 
Slapped him. I speechless. He was no. quite smashing. He was <laughs> smashing. <laughs> oh. He couldn't get enough of power. Okay. okay. There's got to be another way out of here. Uh, sure. Slap, slap. Can I... Where? Where do I go? Oh! Of course. Right. She played her part beautifully. Nice. Should close it. No? Clap. Correct. Oh no, is it the boyfriend? But she sensed the story might not be over yet. Yeah, here I come with my slap slap. Can I run? Please. <gasps> I'm gonna come there and he's not there. He's gone. Ding ding. You better not be in there. When I come back for you, I just need to take the door. Was dying to speak to you, Barbara. Yeah. She heard whispering. Piss, 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 piss. Coming from inside the house. <gasps> oh dear. Slap them. Surprise! Oh my god. You are wonderful. The monsters had come to surprise her. <laughs> For Barbara, it was a dream come true. Then she saw what kind of monsters they were, and she realized what was about to happen. She and with her final breath, Barbara Finch gave the performance of her life. <gasps> he comes to scream. <laughs> I wasn't there myself, but I hear Barbara was magnificent. <laughs> Poor girl. She had a taste for stardom. But unfortunately, so did her fans. Oh my of God. course, the police blamed it all on poor Rick, who disappeared the same night. Mm -hmm. And little Walter, hiding under his bed the whole time. He took it all pretty hard. But that's another story. As for Barbara, tucked inside the music box is all they ever found of her. Huh? Her yeah. What? Now that's what I call a real eerie tale. <laughs> <laughs> also, why is there a pumpkin who delivered that? I don't. Okay. An ear. Sure. Mm hmm. Edie told me all Barbara wanted was to be remembered. As mm. absurd as that comic was. Maybe what Edie saw was a happy ending. Wait, so how old were you? Not old, little lady. Bigfoot? Barb Street? Oh, yeah. Nice. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, anything else now? No, I don't think so. And we couldn't open those, so we'll go through the bra. Through the bra. I guess now I know why mom doesn't like me playing with the music box. Mm-hmm. Whenever people ask me about my family, 
the first thing they always want to know about is Barbara. Hmm. So was that true? Like, oh my gosh, it's really... Now I see it. Ah, Barbara so... was a child star for two years. Mm. Until America grew out of it. No, well, Barbara didn't, apparently. Edie's father, Odin, built the original house. Yeah. Okay, so I didn't actually look through... Oh, the other doors, I was gonna say. Mom must have locked the third floor stairs on the night we left. Sure, your mom was really good at it's funny. closing off doors. All those times I played with the music box and never found the basement key. Mm -hmm. We were already in here, so let's look inside. The last time I was in Edith Sr.'s room, I was 10 and she was painting my portrait. Actually, you were in there like a few minutes ago. Yeah, to be honest. Uh, Gregory? As a kid, I just yeah. assumed every house had peepholes and sealed rooms you weren't allowed inside of. Yeah, completely normal. Absolutely. Uh, totally agree. Yeah. Mm -hmm. My grandpa Sam spent seven years sharing a room with his dead brother, Calvin. Jesus. The rope is back on, I guess. All right, cool. Okay, did that. Um, we didn't look here. Yeah. Molly. Molly always seemed like a girl I could imagine being friends with if she hadn't died in 1947. Of, of course. When she was a shark. Okay. Slowly but surely down the stairs. I didn't look through this one. Edie told me once that every finch who ever lived is buried somewhere in the library. Eh? No one just sealing of doors. Alright. Um, so spinnery, spinnery, spin. Spin. Nice. Cool. We don't have a crutch. Can I? I want to hit with the crutch. Maybe we can turn on the lights now. Yeah, you can take that. I thought it was eyes. No, you see a frog with eyes. I heard one there. Mom said then. the basement was off limits, unless I wanted another tetanus shot. Another? Is it designed for the wagon? Oh, uh, hello, Disney reference, I guess. Okay. Yes? Did you want something? Yes, the famous Saul. I saw oh. Edie sneak down to the basement once, carrying packages. For whom? I thought maybe she was hiding presents. Maybe she's hiding bodies in the... Oh! It turned out she was hiding a lot more than that. Mm-hmm. We should have had some sort of light source going through this. Thank you! I remember Magic asking fairies. mom once about where Walter had gone. Ah. She said after Barbara died, he got as far away as he could. Uh, oh! If there's wow. a pattern in all these stories... I think it's that none of us has gotten very far. Oh my. Hmm. Goodbye, everyone. I can't believe I've been down here for 30 years. Wow. On that first day, after the shaking started, I didn't think I'd survive a week. Oh, no, not my little dude. 
But after a few days, I settled into a routine. Mm. That's what kept me sane. Having a schedule, living for today. I always expect it to be dead tomorrow. Mm. But if you wait long enough, you'll be used to anything. Bye, little dude. Even a monster on the other side of the door starts to feel normal. Almost friendly. Sure. Peachy. Slurp. And then one day, everything just stopped. Hmm. Whatever that thing was, it was gone. Maybe it got tired of waiting. Mm. Or maybe I just got tired of being afraid. You didn't get tired of peaches, though. It's been a week now. The longest in 30 years. No more peaches? I'm done waiting. Hey, well, it only took to you 30 leave. years. Well, I still can. Sure. Oh, no, no. We still want to do that. Okay, yeah. Uh. Hmm. Sure. Tomato sauce. We we had all of this stuff, but we just ate the peaches. Hmm? I know it's out there somewhere. What your sanity? Whatever killed Barbara. Your sanity. And Molly. Oh my god. And who else? And Calvin. Oh yeah? Maybe this is all a mistake. Oh god. Okay. But I need to stop living the same day. Even if it kills me. Hmm. Whatever's out there. I want you to know, I'm ready for it. You're walking on train tracks. You're gonna find I'm going a train. I appreciate all of it, especially the food. Sure. Yeah. I don't um. mind if I only have a year left. Hmm. Or a month. Or a single week. How about two minutes? I'd be happy with one more day. I can hmm. already imagine the sun on my face. I knew it. How did, but he came back and left us, you know, the, the just said. And someone came down here and drew this Walter picture. Walter died when I was six. <laughs> I can't believe my mom never told me he was down here. Hmm. <laughs> the picture of him with the peaches, yeah. Okay, uh, hmm. Peachy, peachy. He did have a lot of, oh my god. The strength of all the other places, huh? Hmm. I'm sure my mom was trying to protect me. Sure. Walter. Hmm. You can do it. Ooh. Heavy door. Hmm. Maybe she was afraid I'd end up like Walter. No, no, go down. I clicked the wrong button. Hmm. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> yep. And now we go down. Are you serious? Okay. Let one more try. Just, let me. Let me. Okay. Keep holding. Yes. Good. <laughs> Yeah, same. Oh, like hobby models. But More if she never figures. told me about an uncle under the house, sure. I can only imagine what else she was hiding. Dude, we don't talk about Bruno. Calm down. 
I don't want to oh. make the same mistakes she made. Yeah, but... Uh, that's a lot more than peaches. Hmm. Trying to bury something that's still alive. Good. Oh. Now that there's only one of us left. Or maybe two. I thought it was time I heard the stories for myself. And found out what happened to everyone else. Mm hmm But now I'm worried the stories themselves might be the problem. Yeah, yeah. Maybe we believed so much in a family curse. We made it real. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What? Hello, Chan. I don't Greedy. know if I should even be writing this. Maybe it'd be better if all this just died with me. What are you on about? Leda, what are you on about? But I thought you should know about your family. Oh. There's a little baby. And the history you're a part of. Mm -hmm. Do we want to go up there maybe? Though to be honest, I feel as lost as you probably do right now. Mm -hmm. I think the people in these stories believed them. For what that's worth. Yeah. history of imagination and stubbornness and madness any of it seems possible imagine building that like what uh, I think we've been surrounded by death for so long we've just gotten used to it yeah, maybe. What kind of family finishes building a cemetery before starting the house? Oh my god. Uh, Norwegian it's ones? It's embarrassing for me to admit this, but... The pet cemetery oh. may be more uncomfortable than the human one. Oh. Three of the gerbils are mine, and... Too had been my fault. Oh. Maybe don't get the gerbil baby. Sven built the house, but it was Edie who designed the cemetery. Oh. Squeeze. Oh my gosh, look at that! Is there a little load in there? Mm hmm. Oh. Is your stuck? Huh. Huh. Wow. Oh. Because he flew. Molly. Barbara. I'm sure Odin's monument had been Edie's idea. Mm. My mom was always trying to move on, but for Edie, the past never went away. She could see it poking out of the water at low tide. Oh. Edie said she dreamed about the old house oh every my. night. Hmm. 
high five. Edie's side was always easier for me to understand. Yeah. But the older I get, the more I can see where my mom was coming from. Mm. Her dad had been pretty strict, but it wasn't enough to save her brothers. She was just trying to do better. Mm. She lost two of her brothers, just like I did. I get why she tried so hard to protect us. Oh, man. We never found Milton's body, so my mom insisted we were putting up a monument, not a tombstone. I guess she's not wrong, huh? There's so many things I wish I could ask my mom now. Was she gone too? Part of me thinks this is what she wanted all along. For you to, for come, to back? come back someday. Yeah. And find everything out for myself. Sure. That's stable. Let's do that. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Oh, this is where we were our cats. But looking back on it now. Yeah. If she told me there was going to be so much climbing, <laughs> I never would have come when I was 22 weeks pregnant. Oh, there we go. Prego, prego. This is the most stupid thing I've ever seen a pregnant woman ever do. Thank God it's not real. <laughs> yeah. I never met Grandpa Sam, but... I think he and my mom had a lot in common. Mm-hmm. Wait, there was this horror game where she was prego too. They were both pretty intense. Oh. Sam spent his life shooting photos, but mom said he got nervous being in front of the camera. I guess we're all afraid of something. Ah. Oh. Well. Hmm. Sure. S. Finch, okay. Rawr. I don't like that. Can we go around it? Ew. Instead of hiding from death, Sam seemed to go out of his way to meet it. <laughs> yeah, he dressed his walls, walls with it. That's, um, that's a choice. That's a choice, I guess. Yep. Got anything for me? Airline ticket? Airline tickets? Okay. Okay. Uh... The sealed door. Oh. Didn't see that. <laughs> Oops. Uh, creepy. Dawn, I promise, you'll never forget this weekend. Yes, sir. These memories are going to last a lifetime. Mm -hmm. Can I move Am around? Am I going to have to shoot anything? It's a hunting trip, Dawn. Shooting is strongly encouraged. Ow. Perfect. It's going to rain the whole weekend, isn't it? We have some interesting... There we are. We'll never forget this weekend, Dad. That's the spirit. Okay, got it. <laughs> I'm gonna take some pictures, okay? Just be careful. A camera's older than you are. Me. Hmm. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> That's a keeper. <laughs> That's cute. I'm just saying. I'm not always gonna be here, Don. Hmm. You'll need to remember this stuff. If you want to survive. I'll be fine, Dad. You know who else thought he was gonna be fine? Some guy who died. <laughs> Don, I'm being serious. Sorry. I know, Dad. You're always serious. Doesn't being out here make you want to chill out? Well, to tell you the truth, I haven't been out here in 20 years. Mm. Don, don't you think you could find something more interesting to photograph? No. Last time I was with my brother Calvin. Man, that was a great trip. Was it? Your grandpa Sven taught us how to fish. Dad! Good eyes, Don. Wow, pretty. Before you take the shot, let me get a picture of you. 
Where? Dad, I... Just breathe. Hmm. Let me get behind you. Do I have to do this? No. Don, you don't have to do anything. Exactly. If you want to survive, you'll need to be strong. Ah, oh, come on. Keep yourself square. Oh my god. Elbows down. Great shot, Don! Oh my god. No. I took a picture of that. Oh my god, dude. Oh baby. I'm proud of you, Don. Always remember that, okay? She's not proud, dude. No. Dad, it's twitching. I think That's it's totally so normal, Don. Oh Just my focus on God, the no. Not to think about Dad! <gasps> okay. Oh my God. Of all these stories, hmm. that's the one I wish most that my mom had told me. Oh, dude. 33 years old? Great. Yeah. Be strong, Don. Be strong. Be strong. My god, man. I don't know. I think that's the room I liked the least, honestly. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, I think I'm gonna take a break here, actually. I don't know how long this game is, but I'm hoping to get at least another hour from it. Uh, leave your comments below if you like this game. Look at this little belly. Also, look at the bear. No, don't look at the bear. Look at the belly. Oh my god, it's a belly. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!